Okay, hello again YouTube, this is Remington H. Okay, well I'm back inside my DX160. Uh, after studying the uh, schematic quite a bit more, um, I realized that I might have uncovered the problem I was having before. The problem that necessitated the screen wire I have connected to the uh, antenna input there's the antenna and there's the input there when I attach the screen wire to the tuning capacitor here I noticed that the sensitivity went from nothing I mean practically impossible to receive a signal to quite strong and um, after looking over the schematic uh, and being prompted to do so by a forum post that suggested uh, replacing this resistor R2 um, that basically shunts the antenna connector to ground to protect against static discharge affecting those two germanium diodes. Um, after somebody had suggested replacing that resistor with a, that 220 ohm resistor with a 5k ohm resistor, 5 yeah, k ohm resistor, it got me to thinking, well, why, in order to increase the uh, gain. They say that resistor decreases gain by about three, um, three uh, s, by about three on the s meter. So, that well, if that's true, then why is that? And after looking at the schematic, I realized that this wire here. That clear wire is the antenna lead going to the RF gain control and then going right back to uh, right back there. Okay, so that makes sense. Um, in my previous video, I had mentioned that the receive sensitivity seemed fine for the first maybe 10 or 15 minutes I had the radio. And it occurred to me that per perhaps static um, discharge may have actually blown out these two diodes one or both of these two diodes within minutes of me having the radio. Uh, there's supposed to be a ground connection here and uh, when you're only using the A1 on the antenna, the, la the, the bottom uh, antenna post here, you're supposed to run a ground, I mean you're, you're supposed to run a wire between these two screws here and uh, I, this radio didn't come with that that wire. So I suspect that grabbing the antenna because I just had bare wires connecting to an outdoor long wire antenna. And I remember experiencing some static discharge when I touched the antenna connection or the antenna wire. So I think maybe possibly some static buildup uh, affected these two probably rather sensitive diodes. Uh, these are germanium diodes. I wasn't able to get exact replacements. Apparently germanium diodes are pretty difficult to get. So I got these, after doing some research online, the shot key RF switch diodes. Um, I wish I had germanium, but I will probably have to order them. But I'm going to try these since these were available at Fry's today. And um, we'll see how they work. So I'm going to go ahead and replace those two. Um, so I'm going to try to go ahead and replace those two diodes and then uh, replace also that resistor. Um, they wanted 5k ohms. I can only find a huge package of 5.1k ohms, but whatever, I'm sure that'll be fine. And then uh, remove that green wire and see if it solves the problem. I'll, I might try to test those diodes with my multimeter. I don't really have, I don't believe I have a diode checker on my cheap multimeter, but I'll give it a shot. I'll see how that goes. Um, all right, I'll be back. Okay, well, you know, I think I'm gonna go ahead and call this a success so far. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and remove the green wire. I've already done so and I've listened to it a little bit. I'm not getting much propagation on 20 meters. 40 meters is working very well. And when I touch the part of the capacitor that made things louder before, before I did this fix, or put touch the green antenna, touch that green wire to the capacitor, uh, all it did was actually reduce the sensitivity on 40 meters. It seems to bring more noise to 20 meters now, but it doesn't actually uh, bring in any signals. So, looks like this was a success. I, I think I, 
probably might come back at some point and replace those with proper germanium, the shot key capacitors with proper germanium capacitors. But so far it seems to work quite well. I'm going to go ahead and put it back together and, uh, and uh, remove the remnants of that fix I did there and uh, try it again and see how it goes. If I get any propagation, I'll, uh, I'll uh, add to the video. And uh,